hello, hello. It is Monday morning, and I'm warming up my car and brushing the snow off my car, too. It's so snowy. It's all covered in snow. And then I'm off to school. So I'm on my way to oh, my hair is stuck. So I'm on my way to school now, and um, it's still kind of dark outside. I have a test today, right when I get to school at, well, my class starts at nine, but I think we're gonna start the test at 9.30, cause my class is three hours, but the test is only two hours. Get what I'm saying, so there's extra time. Um, and um, yeah, so I woke up this morning and decided that today is gonna be an awesome day. Even though I have a test, I'm gonna get over it and enjoy my day. I woke up like early-ish, <laughs> so I didn't have to rush out of the house this morning and it feels pretty good and I'm happy about it. So I just came downstairs. I'm ready to put on my jacket because we're going to my new house. My dog's coming and this is what I see. <laughs> Merlo, do you have your jacket on? He's so angry, he won't walk. Come, come, walk, I wanna see you walk. Look at those sad eyes. <laughs> Rachel, what's going on? Save me. Look, it has a little hood. So cute. It's really cold outside, so we have to put his coat on. Here you come, we go bye-bye now, let's go. <laughs> So I'm here at my new house with my mom, and the biggest update, <laughs> well, oh, we got a railing. I didn't show you guys that. I haven't shown you guys updates in a while. Um, I showed you crown molding, so the painters now came in. They painted all the trim, um, not the baseboards, but like the crown molding and stuff in the hallway. They haven't painted the walls yet or anything. Um, actually, they painted this room here. This is the den. I don't know where all the light switches are. Here we go, they painted this room. <laughs> it's a nice gray color, but um, I'm not gonna show you too much of the paint because the real difference, major update, is the kitchen. So I'm walking here. Honestly, I don't know what all these light switches do. Oh, that one works. Okay, that one too. And that one, I don't think the one in the middle does anything. Anyways. So, update, let me stand here so that you guys can see. It's still a complete mess, but I thought I'd do a little update. So this is the kitchen so far. This is actually a mistake, because look at this. So there's going to be like a countertop here, but there's like no room here. There's a, this should have stopped about here, and then you have like a big gap, you know? They messed that up, I don't know. This is the old fridge that was here, but that's going downstairs, so that's just like sitting in the middle of the floor. Then this is the um, cabinetry. So it's like a white color. My mom picked it and like these really sleek handles. And yeah, oh, this is pretty cool. I think it's cool because I've never seen anything like this before, but this is beside like the fridge freezer. And then it's like these cool racks. Never seen that before. And then there's something else like that here too. Beside the stove. Isn't that cool? I don't know. I've never had a kitchen cabinet do that before. And these are just like regular drawers, obviously. And cabinets. But yeah. So that's the kitchen update. Um, that's pretty much the major update. Did I show you guys the fireplace? And this is pretty cool. It's like a rectangular fireplace, and it's like built up into the wall, so that's pretty cool. Hill. Um, oh, on the outside of the house, we got garage doors, but <laughs> not really gonna show you that. But yeah, so those are the updates on my house. My mom is upstairs. Oh, my bathroom is finished, but everything's all like covered because they're now painting, so I can't really show you that until they're done, so I'm just gonna show you my bathroom when it's all finished. But yeah, these are like the major updates and then the next few weeks we're getting the floor, everything's being painted, everything else is getting installed and then we're gonna move in in less than two weeks. It's like scary and crazy and so surreal. I just came upstairs and I noticed that they painted my office. I don't know if the color is coming up true, but it's like a bluish gray. I like it. 
It looks nice. And then this is the window that I love because the sun shines in this window so much. But um, what you can see through this window, you're probably gonna ask. That thing is a washroom outside because there's a pool. So in case you're wondering, because <laughs> I looked in the camera screen and that's all I saw. Anyways, yeah, this is my office slash filming room and I really love the color. I was kind of nervous about it because I thought it'd be too blue and I wanted it more gray. But it looks good, mom, right? Mom? Oh, she's on the phone. Anyways, I like it. <laughs> okay, I guess since I'm here, I will show you my bathroom. Um, okay, these are the only lights that are still here because the other fixtures came off the wall. And these are just the pot lights that are still here. So, I want to show you that everything is still like wrapped up in plastic so you can't really see. Oh my god, I really want to show you my countertop though. <sighs> Look how pretty! And that's the back splash. That is so pretty. I love it so, so, so much. I haven't really come here very often to like appreciate it. The mirror is still here, but look, it's finished. I don't think I updated this. So this is the inside of my shower that I designed for my bathtub. I'm so, so, so happy. I love it so much. Like when everything's not all wrapped up in here, it just looks so nice all together. Everything looks crisp and white and I'm just loving it. So this is what I designed. I picked out all the tiles and I arranged it in this um, square here. And then over here is where the like faucet and stuff is going to go for my bath. And then that's a nice shelf where I can put all my shampoos and stuff. I'm just so excited. It's really nice because like I designed it so it's like cool to see your designs come to life. And that's just why this whole experience is really exciting for my family and I because we designed everything. So it's like cool to see it all coming to life. So it's super sunny today and I'm actually early for the bus that I'm taking to school. So I thought I'd vlog for a minute. Um, I am disappointed in myself because I have a ton of things to do today because I procrastinated to the T yesterday. And I'm really, really disappointed at myself. You know when you're just like mad because you did it to yourself? <sighs> I seriously need to stop and just get my stuff done. Like push myself. I need more willpower. I don't know if it's because... Like I've actually been sleeping a lot. And I don't know if it's because I'm like subconsciously like upset or like sad or something. I don't know. Or it, I don't know if it's because I don't take vitamins. And I don't because... I don't know, I just have this thing where I feel like your body should nourish itself. Like, you shouldn't have to take vitamins, but, like, I know I should, and I think that's a big cause of it, because I feel like I'm always tired. Like, yesterday, between, like, not last night, but the night before, like, Monday night, I slept for 14 hours, and then um, I took a nap yesterday for two hours. So I slept for 16 hours between Monday night and Tuesday like afternoon and that's ridiculous but I know I just like got over being sick so maybe that's it but I've just like I can't do that I feel like I just sleep because I'm bored or like because I'm procrastinating and it's ridiculous and it's stupid and I'm mad at myself for it so I need to stop not stop sleeping but I need to just use my time better because I'm mad at myself for not doing stuff earlier and I'm always doing stuff at the last minute and it's horrible like I always get stuff done and I guess it just pushes me to get it done in a short amount of time but like oh, student problems but anyways it's a nice sunny day I woke up early because I was gonna get some stuff done but then I just kept pressing snooze so I got up earlier than I normally do so I had a lot of time to get ready but it wasn't enough time to like get some of my stuff done so that was a mess too Anyways, I'm going to go to school now and get on with my day. <laughs> nice chatting with you. So, I would say I just did something pretty bad. I'm parked right now. And I just went to McDonald's. I'm in a rush. <laughs> and I'm doing a bunch of stuff. So, we're all just going to pretend that it never happened, okay? Just pretend it never happened. But this is my second Big Mac in the entire world. Never had, I've only had one other Big Mac before. Oh, I think they got my order wrong. 
This has four patties on it. Is this a double Big Mac? There's people coming. This is awkward. Well, we're all gonna pretend we didn't see this. Awkward. People just walked by, saw me eating in the car. We're all gonna pretend this never happened, okay? Close your eyes, you're not seeing this right now. But, it's pretty damn good. Tastes good, not good for you. I'm embarrassed to be showing you. I never eat at McDonald's. And the few times that I do, I swear I always vlog it. It's like a coincidence. But, I have food in my teeth. And it's very difficult to eat and I'm trying to eat it fast. Because, oh, I'm, <laughs> um, let me explain. I'm picking up Nikki because she asked me to hang out with her. It's Thursday night and I have reading week next week, so I'm pretty much done school. Um, till two, well, till a week and a bit because I don't have class on Friday. And, um, anyway, she asked me to hang out, but I had, like, a promised my mom that I was going to meet her for an appointment at my new house. And I'm moving in a week and three days. It's scary and sad and surreal. Anyways, Nikki's never been there, so I came to pick her up. There's this McDonald's really close to her house, and every time I come here, I just, I'm always tempted. And now I'm thinking about those guys that walked by and made fun of me for eating in my car. It doesn't have time. So it's Valentine's Day, and we just got finished in the movies. This is Ariana, my cousin, and we watched the Lego movie. Did you like it? Yeah. It was good, right? When you got there? In your hands. I got M&M's in my hands. Yeah, and did you have popcorn? Yeah. And your drink, what did you get here? I got... Orange pop? Yeah. Because do you get to drink pop normally? Yeah, sometimes. Sometimes, are you sure? <laughs> it was a treat and now we're heading home but we went to see the Lego movie and it was really cute and I really enjoyed it I liked it a lot there was Batman in the movie <laughs> and it was fun oh my god I just ran upstairs to get my camera I haven't vlogged all day and I'm hanging out with Nikki we're making a smoothie or a milkshake I don't even know what you would call it but we're gonna use Kit Kat ice cream that my mom bought me for Valentine's Day um, strawberries, blackberries, blueberries, mm, maybe not banana. If we put the chocolate, it won't taste good. And like, milk. Okay. Put that much ice cream. Do you think that's enough? Yeah. Maybe more? Yeah, because there's two of us. Okay, yeah, we'll justify it. Mm. Hold it up. Whatever. Oh, you should smell this tea. Tell me what you think of it. This is my um, Forever Nuts David's tea. It, you can't even smell it. Oh. Yeah, you can't smell it. Smell really? It. it smells good. Yeah, you can't smell it. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to vlog myself. Yeah, you can't smell it through these things. <laughs> I'm looking at you and I'm not looking at the screen, so like when you move, I just move <laughs> my body, but I don't move the camera. <laughs> I need a knife, sorry. Is that a knife? Oh, I don't look beautiful, but I, look, I did look nicer last night when I went out for Valentine's Day. Um, I took my little cousin to the movies. I vlogged a little bit, but I didn't really explain much in that clip. But um, I didn't have a Valentine. So I called up my little cousin and I thought I would take her out and spoil her for the night. So we went out to the movies. I picked her up and it was cute because I got to drive her in my car and like, I guess I'm still like, now I'm finally old enough to be responsible for somebody else in public. And it was just us two and it was cute. Okay, how much milk do you really put? Not that much, right? Yeah, don't put a lot. You need ice. But there's ice cream. I'll put some anyways. Um, who, who video was it? I think it was Mac Barbie 07? Maybe. Yeah, she makes a lot of- Yeah, yeah, she did. I think Stila Babo and I made one too, though. 
Hopefully this turns out well. We just kind of threw a bunch of stuff in a blender and, you know, hoped for the, be for the best. Do, 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 do. This is not gonna taste good. The chocolate and the blackberries, but like I don't think that's gonna taste good. It'll be fine. It's not gonna taste. It's good. like I love blackberries, so like it's like you're eating a scoop of ice cream and then a scoop of blackberries. It's like good. I know you put chocolate on fruit. That's the only reason why I'm hopeful. It smells okay. It smells like fruit. Let's get small spoons and try it. Oh, you have a spoon? But yeah, but I liked it, so I'll just have another. Oh, it tastes like straw. Oh my god, it tastes like chocolate covered strawberries. It does, but it's healthy. <laughs> yeah, that ice cream we put in there, it's so healthy. Oh, it's good. I like it. Me too. Yay. Should we put it in like, it's really thick. Should we eat it like ice cream? It's not in a thick. mug? You can't, you definitely can't drink this through a straw. This is like Valentine's Day, but like a day, a day after. Yeah. Post Valentine's Day. You Should right? I use an ice cream scoop? No, it's not that thick. I can try. Who just wants to dirty every dish <laughs> around? I clean the house. I am allowed. <laughs> it works, okay? It makes even portions. Oh, it does actually. <laughs> That's funny. Hey, don't laugh at my. What is eight minutes? I came in like a wrecking ball. <laughs> it was so zoomed in. <laughs> oh, that's awkward. Okay, time to clean up. Uh, it's really good. Now we're cuddled up in our blankets. I'm so bad at showing things. And look, my house, we're moving. So there's boxes and my dog, Merlo. And we're watching 21 Jump Street on TV. So this is our Saturday night. So I'm vlogging us having no life, as Nikki just said before I turn on the camera. Oh, timer's done. I have to flip the chicken nuggets. Basically, making chicken nuggets. It's almost 12 o'clock at night. But no. Are you gonna say the YOLO? YOLO. <laughs> we're making tea in a pot, and then we're gonna pour it in the glasses. But um, we're making the David's tea that I was talking about before. Forever nuts. For almond lovers. And Nikki was amazed that it was pink. Or not amazed, but just pleasantly surprised. Okay, I have the oven open and I just heated it up and now I'm letting all the heat come out. This is really what I'm wearing to sleep right now and I thought it was really funny. So I just wanted to show you. Toronto t-shirt. Gotta represent my city. It's the same color. Like, do we ever match like this? These are pink sweatpants that say pink on the booty. And um, red fuzzy socks that match the red writing. I just thought it was really funny, so I thought I'd just had to show you because I feel... I just really grabbed the clothes that were like closest to me, fresh from the laundry. Put them on to sleep in, and my room's a mess. No one judge me, but I just thought I'd show you my outfit of the night. If you're going to sleep, and I'm going to go to sleep now. Bye. I feel like I only vlog at night, but what you gonna do? I had a lazy day today, and now it's like later at night. I think it's like 9.30 or something. I just did my hair, so I'm like playing with it because it's really soft. But I always point this out, but seriously, my hair is ridiculously long right now, and I really need to get it cut. Yeah, I just finished getting myself ready, and I'm going to hang out with my friends, um, Nikki and Alyssa, because yesterday I hung out with Nikki and Alyssa was supposed to come, but then she didn't because she was hanging out with her parents because she lives away at university. So she was like hanging out with her family because she hasn't seen them in a while and she got home yesterday. So now we're just hanging out like really nothing special. We're literally just going to like hang out at Nikki's house. But um, I was waiting for Nikki and Alyssa to like get ready. So I was like waiting around for them and like I took a shower and did my hair and stuff and got myself ready but I had like extra time so I decided to make my friends Valentine's Day cards because Valentine's Day was on Friday, today's Sunday. So and I haven't, well I saw Nikki yesterday but I haven't seen Alyssa in a long time so I'm like hmm I'm gonna make them Valentine's Day cards like just kind of as a joke but kind of like just because 
just because I'm that cheesy friend, like I'm the friend that always does cheesy stuff for my friends just because like it's kind of like a joke. So I'll show you the cards that I made. I think they're really cute. So I had a piece of pink paper and it was like a regular like eight and a half by 11 paper and I cut it in half and then I folded it into like, um, like a, I don't know, I folded it into a card. And I made each of them different just because I wanted them to be, like, uh, homemade. So I put an N on this one for Nikki and an A for Alyssa. And, like, this pink, the dark pink part is a sticky note. And the white was, like, a scrap piece of paper that I had for my printer. Like, you know when you print something wrong? Anyways, so, um, yeah. And then I just wrote something cute for each person. And they, it both says something different. And then on the inside, um, I wrote, like, the year and then I wrote I hope to look back in 10 years and laugh just another thing to read at my wedding <laughs> like because we're gonna be best friends forever just so that and then uh, call or text me when you read this next because like I want them to keep this and have memories and I put a heart on the back and I just thought they were really cute and funny and um, I might go to the store and get some like discounted Valentine's Day chocolate or something with them but we'll see how the night goes but yeah I'm gonna leave now and head over we're in Shoppers Drug Mart and we're looking at all the Valentine's Day chocolate, but like nothing's on sale. I'm really confused. Why is this it's the post Valentine's Day? It's supposed to be everything on sale now. So oh, are these on sale? There's three of them. It's perfect. One, two, three. I want these. You want My favorite cookies and cream. Oh, I like those too. I had a Hershey cookie and cream bar yesterday. Um, what are we going to do? Are the front, please? So I'm at Nikki's house now and <laughs> look, at, so look at this. Look at this table. We brought Miss Fields cookies. Those are my favorite cookies. Oh, these are Nikki's favorite cookies. Those and are? in in no. in spirit of Valentine's Day, I have a surprise for you guys. Maybe. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I did it on purpose. <laughs> she turned on the camera on purpose. <laughs> wow. I made you guys Valentine's Day cards. Have an N on the front. Mine is name. Yeah, look, guys, they're custom. Don't read it like that. You read it wrong. Wait, I mm. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. No, 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 wait. Wait, wait. Alyssa, don't read yours yet. Nikki, read yours out loud, and then Alyssa has to read hers. <laughs> I know. Yeah. <laughs> to my love on Valentine's Day, or <laughs> the Sunday after, I just wanted to remind you that you, like, you spelled? Yeah, because I forgot the R's. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Put you it in after. You are very special to me. I just wanted to make sure I did something cheesy because I am that friend. Homemade <laughs> card and all. Like, that's not even a sentence. <laughs> oh, but it's the should say it. Yeah. <laughs> I love you <laughs> so very much. Again, like, what is that? But it's cute. P.S. You have a cute butt. <laughs> hope you smile. Love you, Phil. I hope you look back in 10 years and laugh. Just another thing to read at my wedding. Call or two. <laughs> okay, your turn. Okay. To my love on Valentine's Day or the Sunday after. Okay, just, that line I, it was, it wasn't <laughs> original. It wasn't even special. <laughs> I just wanted to remind you that you were very special to me. That was a repeat too. Okay, it? sorry. The next part is more original. Yeah. <laughs> this long distance thing is killing me. Okay. But distance makes the heart grow fond. We <laughs> handmade this. <laughs> she did it publicly, so like it's not even that surprising. I handmade this card just because I know you will laugh. I am that friend. You see, she did laugh. <laughs> had to keep up my rep. Yes, you have a cute butt too. <laughs> also, she had to go first. <laughs> I, got it. I definitely planned it that way. And then that I wrote the same thing just so that you'll remember. Oh, okay. I'm gonna read it again. <laughs> Call, text me when you read this next. Yeah, like in 10 years or something. Oh. <laughs> Your only originality is the front. Hey, no, the inside was clever. I, know, I got more hearts than you. Hey, Mine are bigger. Did you get one on the butt? Yes, I did. On the butt. <laughs> on the back. I did. <laughs> yes, because I'm that friend. That friend. Oh, I put my hair in here. Okay, time to eat or eat, stuff our face with cookies. I'm at home now and it's about 2 o'clock, just past 2 o'clock in the morning. But I'm hungry so I decided to make some soup. So I'm going to eat that and then go to sleep. But I thought I'd just show you my delicious soup. It's just like sitting there and I'm going to pour it in a bowl now and take it upstairs. So I just thought I'd say goodnight and end my vlog here. I hope you guys all enjoyed and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.